Hey guys, and welcome back to Resident Evil Village. Where we last left off, we found a couple more molds to use for the uh, mold machine downstairs. Only thing is, I swear... I can hear a... Um, I swear I can hear a... A horse head thing. A goat, I should say. Sh oh, there it is. How the hell are you meant to hit that? Oh, man. That's going to be a little bastard, isn't it? Ah, oh, fuck. Well, I mean, you do get a decent amount of time, I suppose. I've got an idea. I've got an idea. I've got an idea. We have a sniper rifle. So, if we use that and we go all the way down, I'm wondering if we can use the rifle to look back up at it. Yep, really glad we didn't have to fight all of these things, just a few. Right. Now, where was... How far up? There he is. That was a really slyly hidden one, actually. Okay. So. We need to go all the way back down to B4. Luckily, B5 doesn't work. And that is okay with me. Alright. Oh. Broken. Yeah. I thought we left the lights on. Well, that doesn't bode well for us, does it? That's okay. We've got a gun. Ah, this place is going to be crawling, isn't it? Still, we need to make the ball and we need to make the key. Oh, there he is. Knew it. Come on, dude. Let's get you fucked. Ooh, that was close. That was as close as it gets. Whew. That was as close as it gets. Okay. Now, where was... Where was it? Just go down a floor, okay. Now we're going to want to be as careful and as quiet as we can. Because you know there's going to be more of those motherfuckers. Even helicopter head. Wouldn't be surprised if that... Oh! Here we go! That's fine. Glad these are the weak ones. You right there, buddy? You seem to be having a bit of a bad time. Whew. Jesus. Okay. We're good. Oh, it's not dark in here. Well, that's good, I guess. Right. Cool. Let's go for the key mold. Shame we can't manufacture ourselves up some weapons. I bet these molds are really freaking heavy as well. Just be carting these bastards around. Right, there's Heisenberg's key. Um, and the ball mold. But we still haven't actually found the statue or the actual puzzle that the ball goes in yet which is interesting iron horse mold now before we go upstairs 
What was that? Oh, that's that. That door's locked. Yeah, Heisenberg's quarters. That was this way, apparently. Yes. Oh, great. Ghouls inside. Well, I'd rather fight ghouls, admittedly, than anything else. Apparently that's what these things are called, by the way. That's fine. Now these are VR Helmet Ghouls. I don't know if that's their official name, but that's what I like to call them. Come on. Come to daddy. Let's be having ya. Yeah, you unlocked it. We did. We definitely unlocked it. We unlocked it and let the monsters out. Gunpowder? Alright, not bad. So, where are we? This is Heisenberg's own quarters. Yeah, you know we're going to be... F oh, we're going to be finding some... Ah. Some really fucked up stuff in here. Treasures. So that makes his hammer... Heisenberg's hammer. Giant hammer made from machine parts. It's too heavy to use. Okay. That surprises me. Ooh. Lots of scrap and gunpowder. So how... That can't be all that's here. That can't be all that's here. So how do we get into there? The operating room. Because uh, that door's locked. One second, guys. Okay, cool. We're back. Right. So... so there doesn't appear to be any kind of door here. I mean, that looks like a door but uh, I guess it isn't okay uh, in that case oh we really don't have a lot of bullets either do we right in that case let's go back down here yeah this is apparently is a corridor that still has stuff I have no idea what. And it's really annoying me. That's got to be a gem or something. That's probably all it is. But a gem would actually be really nice. And I'm guessing... I'm guessing if we go check the other door, maybe we can put the key in the other side. I can't remember. I can't remember if that needed a key or not, to be honest. Where the hell? Oh, you know it. You know. It's just going to be like, oh, an explosive round there. Oh, okay. Well, you know, I mean, an explosive round is nice. Now, would I have preferred a gem over an explosive round? Uh, not sure, actually. Right, let's get out of here and see if we can finally open that other door. We're so close to getting out of here. Uh, oh, they're all gone. Well, that's ominous as fuck. Yeah, they're all... Oh, oh no, okay. 
They are all gone, but... Alright, cool. Yeah, they're all gone, but um, I think we've killed the ones that are active, I think. There is blood going this way, though. Was there always blood going this way? Also, it's no longer dark. Yeah, how do we get in here? All right, there's power to it now. That makes sense. Right, so what the f fuck, Knuckles, is going on in here? Definitely have those bad boys. Is this where we've got to f fight helicopter guy? Uh... There's a lot of spicy mofos in here. Ah, oh, look at them. I mean, they look dead. But that don't mean nothing, Chief. Flashbangs. Definitely have a flashbang or two. Oh. Here we go. Evening, gentlemen. Uh, can we have a flashbang, please? I really don't like the way we switch weapons. There we go. Switch ammo types. It's not as seamless as it was in 3 make. At least I don't think so. He's done. Crystal Mechanical Heart. Right, let that be a lesson to any of you other bastards that want to get up. Nice amount of handgun bullets. Right, there's got to be more in here. Medical log. Oh. Revitalization surgery. This is my 18th attempt. The subject is Oscar the Stable Boy, 20 Oof. years old. He fell down the well while drunk. Body is in good condition. <clears throat> Chest incision complete. Now to remove the heart and vital organs and implant the control device. Excellent. Cadeau has begun adhering to the nervous system. It's progressing even faster than before. Seems upping the ratio of meta-albumin in the artificial blood was the right choice. Now to pass a current through the brain stem using 6,600 volts. Come on. It has to work this time. Yes. Yes! Ha 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 ha! Wonderful! My creation! At last! I'll get that bitch yet. <laughs> Ending recording. That guy, man, his voice is just weird. And ooh. Long barrel for the wolfsbane. Ending recording. Right, very nice. Very nice. Plus 200 damage. That is a very nice weapon. It's like saying I have Red Dead 2. Okay. Well, I mean, if is that all that's here, really? I mean, don't get me wrong, that was cool. So these are all failed experiments. So he took all their vital organs out. And they've got like an artificial, I don't know, like Iron Man device in their chest. Which is a bit odd. Uh, right. That takes over that functionality. I guess it just provides power to their brain. Because, I mean, that's all really... 
um, your heart and all does, isn't it? It just, you know, provides power to your body. It's your power plant. I mean, it's quite a lot more complicated than that, but you get what I mean. Um, hmm, okay. Electrical impulses and whatnot. Oh! Oh, God, we've got a big boy. We've got a big boy. Oh, reload, you dickhead. This weapon just constantly empty. Right, let's... Ah, oh, fucking reload to the other ammo. Why is that so hard in this game? Nope, the other ammo, you utter fucking dingus. There we go. Oh, I can see a heart chest. Oh, this is the Panzer. This is that Sturm Panzer thing that we've read so much about. Oh. It's almost like a tyrant, a mechanical tyrant. Oh, I expected more, actually. Oh, here he comes. Not bad. I think Wesker definitely could have done a little bit more than you. You're not exactly going to replace... Ow, oh, that hurt. Oh, that hurt. Yeah. I mean, you're not replacing any of the tyrants that we had before. But you're... Oh, perfect crystal mechanical heart. But you're... You're up there. Damn, I was not expecting to come into contact with that thing. But... I think we're safe to get the fuck out of here now. Of sorts. Are we safe to leave? Are we going the right way to leave? Oh. Oh, there's another one. Of course there's another one. Why wouldn't there be? Right, well, let's take this guy to the... Ooh. Let's show this thing a thing or two about ballistic weaponry, if we can. Ooh, that's going to hurt. Oh, yeah, that's the hit of the whole fruit right there. Come on, dude. Let's see that heart of yours. There we go. We can do this all day, my friend. Holy shit. Well, I'm glad we chose to come back this way. Right. Nice. Two perfect crystal hearts. And a couple more enemies dispatched. So let's go get Big Boy back up here. Sell him some stuff. Hey, friend. Wakey, wakey. <laughs> I haven't seen that before. Actually fell asleep. Well, then, feel free to peruse. You lazy bugger. Right, let's give you that. Wow. They were worth hunting down. They really were. And Heisenberg's hammer. Alright, not bad. You were part with this? No, no. I'm more than happy to purchase it. Hmm. You like some strange things, I'll be honest. Uh so don't really want to spend out upgrading the Wolf's Bane just yet. 
Not opposed to upgrade. Oh, can't upgrade that though. Ammo capacity, yeah. What do we have in the shotgun? I look forward to seeing the fruits of your exploration. Right, if okay. Them, window shop away. Okay, so we're topped off with most of our weapons. <clears throat> um Pay me no mind. Let's Is this the best gun in the game though? Hmm, is it time to start hoarding our money again? I'm not sure. Is this the best shotgun in the game? Oh, we, we're at the end of the game, right? Are we? Uh, I mean, we've obviously got to fight Mother Miranda, so unless she's got her own Have bit. A wonderful adventure. I'm not sure. I mean, let's start saving for now. Because that would suck if we actually, like, you know... Have another... Ah, the journal, yes. So, let's see. Uh, I put the four flasks in the giant's chalice and moved it to the ceremony site where the ground gave way and the stone bridge appeared. There's some kind of garage or warehouse on the other side. Heisenberg's place, I presume? I don't want to be part apart from Rose, but there's a little left to do. Wait for me, my dear. Oh, Rose. Ethan. Heisenberg asked me to help him, but he just wants to use Rose against Miranda. Miranda, Heisenberg, they're all the same. Fighting over Rose's power, something that's no match for any of them. Crazy. I mean, Rose is... she's just a baby. I need to get to the surface so I can save her. Right. Well, let's head up to the surface. Or at least... As high up as we can go. I think this guy needs to hit the treadmill. But then he's obviously one of these blessed people anyway. Okay, here we go, here we go. Right, Heisey, coming for your ass, boy. You really are, are a tough one. But I'm tired of chit chat. Time to die. Yeah. You can hear it, can't you? Someone waiting for you. Yeah. That's ominous. Still, if it's a chance to get some supplies. A prototype Sturm using a cheap turboprop engine. Oh, used a cheap turboprop engine. But he's impossible to control. All he does is charge. Too much power output from the reactor? Question mark. Completely invincible head on. But the dumbass managed to chop its own damn arms off on the propeller. Also, issues with overheating from running for long periods of time. Conclusion, complete failure. Oof. <laughs> he chopped his own arms off. Uh, I guess we've got to go do this dance of death with our friend Sturm. What we like for loot here. We all loot it out. Okay. Sturm. So he overheats if he runs for long periods of time. All right. Okay. Uh, if he's going to be a chargey boy, we're going to need la. Oh God! Look at the. F oh Jesus. That's going to be where we fight him, isn't it? Yep. Here we go. Oh my god, he's bigger than I thought. Yeah. Don't think he's going to be getting out of our way. Okay. Oh god. 
Okay. Okay. The f fuck. I'm guessing this is the way to defeat him. I'm basing that on absolutely nothing. Oh. There we go. Right. Hear him charging. Trouble is, you can't see the fucker. What the hell? He's just got like a massive engine strapped to his head. Okay. Doesn't seem too bad. Run, run, run. So you just gotta wait until he crashes into a wall. And then shoot him in the reactor. Which is interesting. I mean, that's quite an efficient reactor, to be honest, if it can indefinitely power a turboprop. That's not too shabby at all. I'm glad he's smashing this room up, because he's actually making this battle a lot easier than it would have been if he didn't. Right, let's break out the big guns. Sniper rifle ammo, 10 rounds. Yeah, that's the hit. That, oh, dear. Oh, he's on fire now, baby. Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, Sturm? Can we not do that, buddy? If that's quite... Oh, God. Okay, so now... Ooh, now he's taking more hits. Now he's taking quite a few hits. Yeah, he's having serious problems. He's having serious fucking problems right now. Oh god, we're burning, we're burning. Yeah, so it looks like he's got to hit the wall about three times. Yeah, about three times, I'd say. Uh oh, hide. Whoa. I'm hoping we've got enough ammo. I'm going to say we probably have. This is a very powerful weapon. And there's equipment and supplies everywhere. So fingers crossed we can grab that after. Oh, nice. Oh, you shitter. Oh, he's gone out. Yeah, he's not giving you a lot of time to aim at all. Got to be honest, he's not quite as scary. Not quite as scary when you can avoid him. Oh. Kind of a bit of a joke, actually. Maybe he has a second form. I mean, come on, dude. There we go. He's eaten up again. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Fire. Alright, so I thought that was just like a single phase. I guess not. Ooh, hello. Hello. Can I get past, please, Sturm? Dude. Alright, that was almost bad news bears right there. Almost. We just got to get him to knock his head around a little bit. Come on, dude. Give yourself a bit of headache. Knock yourself out. There we go. You alright now, dude? There you go. Cooled off a little bit and blew out some of that excess steam. Here he comes. I mean, seriously. This guy, honestly. I really thought this guy was going to be... A bit of an arsehole, to be honest. Just got to wait for him to cool off, I think. Once he's, like, not glowing red anymore. Wish we could kind of put him out, to be honest, because this is annoying. Right, there we go. Ooh. That's cool. Ah, oh, fuck on fire. Uh oh. Run. Run. Okay. 
He's still burning. Maybe he doesn't go out a second time. Maybe? Nope, he's gone out. Let's put a fresh mag in here. Unless there's something else we're meant to be doing. Shit. Yeah, you can actually see the meat chunks where his arms were. That's quite cool. I mean, I guess this Heisenberg dude's supposed to be some kind of like mechanical genius. I guess. And he he just like spraying. How comes he has a flamethrower? That's what I wanna know. Like why does this You know what? Why why are we asking these questions? Oh dear. I guess it doesn't matter why he has a flamethrower, does it? The point is he has a flamethrower. And he has a real bad attitude as well. But I guess that's none of our business right now. Yeah, hopefully. Oh god, he's bouncing around. Oh god, here he comes. Yep, he's crashed. How are you doing, buddy? Ooh. I think he's done. Now stay down. I think he's done. Ooh. Ooh, that was an act of kindness. Complex mechanical heart. Oh, Jesus. And we actually picked up everything there was to pick up here. Which I don't, I don't know actually. I was going to say, I don't think there was an awful lot here to pick up. But actually, wasn't that much here. Yeah? So, Mr. Heisenberg, you still feeling fairly confident, are you? I don't know if I'd rate your chances, to be honest. Right, what have we got in here? Chem fluid. Very nice. What else do we have? A cigar. Miranda is abominable. Her uh, deceit knows no bound. We're merely a bunch of failed Caddo experiments. Ah, so they're all right, Caddo experiments to her. I was just lucky. I had more affinity to the stuff than the poor schmucks in the village. So she still calls me her son. What a joke. I'll never forgive her what she for what she did to me. That crazy bitch has never been right in the head. She can't see a difference between experiment and family. Miranda didn't change my body. She took my dignity. If I don't kill her, then my life will never be my own. Still, she may be crazy, but she's also powerful. She can turn into anyone using the megalocyte. Megalomycite? The trick is that brat, Rose... If I could access her... Wait, did she become... Uh, the trick is that brat rose. If I could access her power, then maybe... Uh, power, then maybe. Speaking of, the kid's dad, Ethan, is a pretty interesting... Has a pretty interesting body himself. Maybe I could get him to help me out. Did we shag Mother Miranda? Did she turn into... Um, no. She, no way. There's no way, is there? Mother Miranda didn't turn into... Um, our missus, did she? Mia. There's no way. Oh, hello. Surely not. And we gave her the old uh, <coughs> chem fluid, shall we say. Knocked her up. And she became... Uh, she gave birth to Rose. And this whole, like, kind of Rose baby has been a bit of a lie. It's kind of an interesting story, actually. But I, I don't know, man. I don't know about that, Chief. 
Because I still don't think Mia was Mia in the beginning of the game. I, nah, the way she reacted to those bullet shots and whatnot. Uh, and the way, she, look, here's the thing. She didn't want to talk about the past, right? So either she didn't know about the past or, uh, no, some, no, 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 something's not right there. Something's definitely not right. Anyway, guys, we're out of time, so I'm going to stop recording. <laughs> <laughs> and when we come back, we're going to go into the cargo room, which I'm guessing we're going to go face Heisenberg now we've trashed all of his machines. Um, but yeah, something about that whole thing. I don't know. No. No, I'm not buying it, Chief. I think we've been living and possibly shagging um, Mother Miranda and not Mia. Maybe Mia's been dead for a long time. Hmm. I don't know. I guess we'll find out together. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. And as always, till next time.